Hello everyone, my name is Trooper, and welcome back to a, another video to show you guys how to install a custom K9 script into your guys' 5M server. All you guys need to do is hit the first link down in the description below. That will bring you guys right here to the download page for MTH K9. This is probably one of the best K9 scripts out there. I found it has pretty much next to no issues and a lot of them have tons of bugs. So all you guys want to do, hit code and download zip. From here, we're just going to open that on up. Going to minimize to our desktop and we're going to find our 5m server mine's right here on my desktop cubicore and then we're going to go into tx data cfx default or cubicle framework depending on your framework installed and then resources and inside of here it's sort of up to you whether you want to just drag and drop it into resources or you can make a subcategory folder like i have here and because it is a menu i'm going to put it into the menu subcategory folder just briefly, I wanted to tell you guys about my new website, hcnetwork.1, which actually sets up a 5M server for you. If you guys cannot be bothered to deal with all the management and having to add in mods and things like that, you can literally just check out my website down in the description below, www.htnetwork.1, and you can set up a 5M server in literally just a couple of seconds using the included auto installer, and it will have already over 120 plus mods. That's custom vehicles, custom maps, custom menus, literally everything you guys can need, and you literally did not have to do anything. So check that out down in the description below www.hcnetwork.1 so all you guys need to do to make that is simply right click new folder and simply just name it whatever you guys want as long as there is brackets at the beginning and the end that makes it a subcategory folder so anything inside of it is automatically started so i'm going to just place it into here just like so and i'm simply going to remove this main dash part right here so it just says mth and dash k9 and we are done with that download we can close that one down if we take a look in this folder, you guys should be able to see we have a config.lua as with most menus. And in here, we can configure pretty much all the settings that you guys will want, such as using a command or a key bind. The default key bind is O, and then the command is slash K9. Obviously, you then can configure it with ace permissions, so only police can have it, and et cetera, et cetera. And here's a bunch of other keys you can change as well. So it's actually pretty customizable, which is nice. You can close that, make sure you save if you do make any changes. And as long as you guys have either drag and dropped it into an existing folder, we should be able to start our server on up. But if you dragged and dropped it into a new subcategory folder or a folder itself, copy the name of the folder, go back to Kubicore Framework or CFX default, open your server.cfg on up, scroll on down to your last ensure line and simply type ensure, if I can spell it correctly, ensure, and then paste the name of the folder. And then you can just hit file, save, and you guys can close your server.cfg. And from here, we should be good to start our server on up and use our new K9 menu. Once you have loaded in, it's up to you if you want to press O to bring up the menu, or you can do slash K9. It's up to you which one you want to do, but it's pretty easy to use. So we can pick the dog that we want if you want a Rottweiler or a Shepherd. And then you can change the dog's name to whatever you guys want, and then simply just spawn the dog. From here, you've got all of these commands, and they're actually really, really good. Like you can put them in a car, you can get them to follow, you can attack. And also, obviously, in the config, it did give you the shortcut key by instead of using the menu to get them to do all of this. But it's a really, really solid script, and there's literally nothing out there that does this without being buggy. So props to the mod creator. They've done a really, really good job, and it's super simple to install. If you guys did find this video useful, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and comment down below what video you guys want to see next, since I'm always looking for ideas and tutorials if enough of you guys want to see it. And also be sure to check out my new website, hcnetwork.1, down in the description below if you guys are looking to set up a 5M server. I would rather do it all automatically within one click. HC Network can do that using the application we provide. Check that out down in the description below and I'll see all you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.